Hi guys and welcome to Becca's Backyard, my weekly vlog where I share with you my inside thoughts outside. Um, and here I am in my backyard, um, but for those of you that watch regularly, you might notice I'm sitting here with my umbrella out. Um, and that is because of a secret that I have discovered, uh, or some news or whatever you want to call it. Um, <laughs> uh, I am actually going to be going on vacation next week. Um, every year I try at least um, once a year to go someplace I've never gone, and that time of year is now. Um, and so I'm leaving tomorrow, which is Sunday, um, and uh, I'm actually recording this on a Saturday. <laughs> so I'm sitting here uh, in my backyard on Saturday afternoon, when I usually record on Sunday morning for you, um, and I'm pre-recording. And though this is going to be watched by you guys at the regular time that I post, which is Sunday afternoon, um, I'm actually recording it early because I'll be traveling tomorrow. Um, and that's really fun and exciting for me. Um, and so I've been doing all day, you know, my, my getting ready and yesterday, my getting ready stuff. Um, and one of the last things that I do is sort of tidy up the tech um, for my time that I'm going to be away, you know, put up my away message, um, make sure that I have posts up and things like that. Um, but as I was coming up to that time and getting ready to think about recording this video, I said to myself, you know what, what if I really use this break as a break? What if I really made it um, truly self-care? And I said, I'm not going to do technology because the truth is that where I'm going to be, I'm not going to have a lot of um, cell signal and I'm not going to hopefully be sitting still long enough to be doing it, um, though I am hoping to have some quiet time to write. Um, so in thinking about that, I thought, well, what if I did that? And I sort of take it as an experiment. It's been a really long time for me since I've been kind of really without technology, really said, um, you know, not just I'm putting it down and not answering work emails or something like that, um, but where I've genuinely gone without it. Um, you know, I grew up without it for a certain, um, but it's something that's become such a part of our lives these days um, that it's difficult. And then for me, it's sort of layered on top of it with the fact that my community is mostly, I, I connect with them online and and through the internet and the same thing for my friends and my social life. Um, and, you know, it, it's really not just for me a place where I do work or I just go on when I have a free moment, but it's really where I do the majority of my connecting with people. Um, and so it's going to be kind of isolating a little bit, I think, to be without technology for me. Um, but maybe that's a good thing in very much the same way that sitting still and, and trying to hear the universe a little bit. Um, what does a week of trying to hear the universe feel like? A week where um, everybody knows I'm going to be gone. I know that I'm not going to be available. Everybody's been told all my emails are covered. So there's genuinely not um, a reason to check in. And so I'm going to give it a go, you guys. I'm really, I'm going to try. I'm going to try and go without tech as much as possible, though I have set myself a writing goal. Um, I have a couple of blog pieces that I've been waiting to work on and definitely some more stuff for Spectrum Women that I've been waiting to write. Um, and I'm working on a bunch of other projects that all need me to be in that creative brain space. And that usually happens for me when I sit and listen to the universe for a while. So I am taking my computer. Um, so that I can get some writing done. But other than that, I think I'm, I'm really genuinely going to take a break. And so hopefully when I come back, I will not only have writing and photos and really good stories to share with you, I hope, um, but um, I hope that I'll come back kind of refreshed and with not only things I've written while I was away, but hopefully lots and lots of ideas and things to share with you um, when I'm recharged and kind of inspired. Um, that's that's what it does for me. Seeing someplace I don't uh, already know, um, and it's not part of my routine, and it's not related to work and just traveling to, to actually do the traveling. Um, I'm excited for it, and it is a bucket list trip for me. So I am like super excited, like that kind of excited um, to do it. Um, but. I have to say I'm still a little anxious about the no tech part. I'm not going to lie. It, I'm a little nervous about it. Um, I remember what it feels like to be isolated um, and not be able to feel connected to other humans. And I don't like it. Um, and I hope that that doesn't get dragged up a little bit. Um, but I think that's just my nerves talking because what if the opposite happens, right? What if, um, 
what if I have an amazing time? What if I like no tech? Uh, what if I really like it? And then it's probably going to be hard to come back. Um, lots of what ifs. I'm doing that thing where I'm trying to what if. And, and I know no amount of worrying is going to change how that's going to work out. So I'm excited. It's, all, it's an adventure for me. It's a, a really big kind of go out in the world and see what I can, can do out there thing and experience it all and really be mindful and present in the moment. Um, the way I used to feel when I was a little kid. Um, I'm hoping I can experience a little bit of that again. I liked that freedom of being a little kid and, and playing more. So I hope this is good experience for me. I really do. Um, well, in any case, I'm going to get inside because I should probably get packing. And no, this was not a last minute thing. It's a choice that I make. Um, packing is one of the last things that I do um, because it actually makes my pets kind of nervous when I go away and their routine gets interrupted. So I try to um, kind of limit their anxiety a little bit by not getting the suitcases out so that they have to start smelling and inspecting and all of that stuff until the very end of when I can. And that is right about now. So I'm going to go in and pack. Wish me luck. I'll see you after a week of no technology. It's going to be so weird. Um, okay, guys. Have a good week and I'll see you in seven days.